Hello everybody, in this video I'll be showing you the basics of a firefighter and emergency response to Liberty County. For gear, you might want to, you probably want to equip every single thing except accessories like that. Um, and you could, um, all these pretty much help like cones, monitor for NPCs, heavy chainsaw for trees, medic back for, um, people. Ladder to get to higher places, simple fire hose to put out fires, and like everything like that. So you pretty much want to equip everything, I guess. But um, for uniforms, you should wear, I guess, just a regular one. Or um, when there's a, if you have special operations, you might want to wear a level uh, well, might want to wear a level C suit, level B suit, or level A suit. But that's pretty much it for gear and uniforms. For vehicles, I would recommend either as a starter, um, you might want to, as soon as you get a fire engine, use it. And then don't use heavy rescue. And then you should get usually use the ambulance. And then after that, you might want to use ladder truck if there's a fire and it's on a high building. But otherwise, use an ambulance since you don't need a hose and you can just use a simple fire hose. And then um, you can also get the brush falcon advance, um, which has a nozzle on the front, which you can spread, you can put fires out without getting rid of the car. So that I'd recommend this one. To I I recommend to always use the bullhorn ambulance, and then use the ladder truck for fires that are really high, and then use the brush falcon advance for f a lot of fires. And also, the international ambulance isn't as good as the bullhorn ambulance because the bullhorn ambulance is faster. I'm pretty sure, and it you can um it's quicker to put a patient in since you can on the side right here you can put a patient into that little window in the door. I mean, but international ambulance you can't put do it. There's no there's no door, so I'd recommend using the bullhorn instead of the international. I just drive to a bushfire. So which one do you see have a fire hose? Is you wanna Oh, the simple fire hose. You want to just hold quick and try to spray at the fire. And just go all the way to um to the fire until it's out. So, like, spray right here. And then when it disappears, there's going to be another fire. You have to keep going all the way up for trees. There's just going to be trees, fires, bush fires. And there's also going to be house fires. So, this is how to revive someone with a minute bag. You're going to equip your medic bag and hold the E for a computer to heal. And then once they're up, you can also hold the E to heal them like this. And they'll heal all the way back to full health. You can heal anyone at any health. This is how to revive an NPC. What you're going to do is place your monitor right next to them. And then click on them about four times or more. And then hold E for treat. And then expect patient. Inspect patient. And you're gonna wait until you're done. After you're done, you're gonna hit continue, perform treatment. You have to wait. And then you pick up your monitor, get them on the stretcher, and take them to your ambulance. You can only do this with an ambulance, but you can you can only take them to the hospital with an ambulance. But you can um you can treat them either uh either way with a um either if you don't have an ambulance or not or if you do. After you put your patient, take your patient, put them in your um, ambulance, you're going to take them to the hospital, which is right about here. It's right here. And you're going to wait right here and drop them off. And just stay right here. If you want to stay in your car or just leave it, they'll get, let's say, patient successfully dropped off and you'll get XP for it, which is 15. 15 XP. So, unfortunately, I didn't really have enough time to show you how to put out oil. With the oil absorbent, you just as it as my DOT video, you just stand on the oil and just put uh, just cold click and just let it sit on the oil and it'll disappear. And also for hazmat neutralizer, um, you spray it on the hazmat, but you also want to wear um a hazmat suit. Now, um, I'm not sure about anything else for firefighter, but um, I'll put it in the description and please tell me in the comments if there's anything I need to add. And that is it for today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed. And don't forget to like and subscribe.